What's up guys, Justin Nash had the boss here. Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're gonna do something completely different. Normally we like make game videos, I make game videos. They're pretty shit. And I realized that my three year old laptop that I've been using for school is starting to get a bit hot. I mean like I use it for 20 minutes. <laughs> it reaches like 80 degrees. That's kind of concerning. And it just it starts to throttle. It's so fucking annoying. So I decided to um put thermal paste in it or thermal compound. And this video is going to be for anyone who has this kind of laptop and for anyone who wants to know how to put a put th new thermal paste on a new CPU so yeah if the first thing you gotta do is take off the screws like I'm doing and then what you gotta do is pry open the top bit I mean it may look like I don't give a shit but I've done this multiple times so it makes a whole heap of clicking noises and <laughs> god damn I spilt all the screws everywhere. Yay. Okay, if you are small brain and you've done that, you just clean them up and put them in a certain area like I've done. I mean, most people just say, oh, take off the, take off the thing. No, don't do that. Don't you, I mean, I don't get why people say that. You can do it if you want, but I don't recommend it. Now what you gotta do is take off the CPU, the two, the two screws on that little box, you just gotta take them out, <laughs> sorry for putting my hair there, yeah. yeah, yeah, that's what I'm touching right now is the RAM, that's where the RAM goes, if anyone, if, if anyone didn't know that, that's how you upgrade your RAM. That's where the hard drive is. So yeah, I mean, if you guys want to know how to put the hard drive in, just comment down below or something. And yeah, I really had a big problem with the CPU area because the whole thing didn't completely come off. So this bit's a bit hard to see, but basically you get like a tissue and wipe off the existing thermal compound you do that for the CPU bit and I can barely see it yeah it's hard to really it's really hard to see because it's all dark in that area so yeah what you gotta do is do that take off all that stuff make sure it's nice and clean and then you gotta do the top bit as well as I will do in a second, yep, there it is. I'm doing the top bit now. All you gotta do is do it real good, cause this is your CPU, this is the most important bit of your system and if you mess it up, you destroy a pin, you're done bro. I was, th this is such a bad example. You gotta be like really careful and I wasn't at all careful. I mean, I, I suck at like make doing stuff in front of a camera. And what you gotta do is get your thermal compound. It's really hard to open. <laughs> and I don't know why. The last time I used it, it was like got stuck on real hard. So once you've opened up your thermal compound, like I've just did, now you have to put a tiny, tiny blob. On the CPU, the little box thing that's not connected, like I'm doing here. Put the tidiest bit on, and as you can see, I'm being really careful. So if you put way too much on, it will stuff it up. But if you do, don't don't worry. Like I've done, you can just use a tissue and wipe up, wipe it off wipe a tiny bit off which I'm doing right now and this is 
you have to put it on the CPU like I've done it push it down yep now you gotta screw back on the screws for the CPU there's there's supposed to be a uh, screw for that little box that my hand is like right under I don't know where that screw is I've never opened it up before so yeah <laughs> now what you gotta do is put the back back on <laughs> pun intended and put all the screws back in the holes like I'm doing right now I mean yep that's that's basically it it's pretty easy eh just saying one of my screws <laughs> went into like fell down so this is the end of the video if you liked it consider subscribing if you liked it consider liking if you liked it consider disliking <laughs> and comment down below if you like this stuff and I'll make some more videos and tell me anything particular that you want to learn see you guys later